All right, let's go. I'm going to do a follow-up video because that's what I was led to do. Now, this follow-up video is for dreams. It is definitely for a dream that I had that I trusted and I posted. Yes, mommy? You play? You play? Yeah. Yeah. So, I don't know. I, um, I got a message earlier from God. He was like, what you told this person it turned out to be true. Well, let's try that again. Let me reword that. Let me put it in his words. He said, such and such has found out that what you said was true and they want to apologize to you. So I'm like, okay, is that why you're telling me to do a video? Should I do a video on you know, the dream. And he's like, nah, just do a video to kind of basically do a video for that person. So that's what I'm doing. Let's see. God, what messages do you want me to deliver to that Gemini? Let's see. Family. And boundaries. Yeah, because this person, they allowed someone into their family where they should have put forth boundaries. Um, this person's grandmother came to me in a dream. Yep. Courage. And justice so okay so this person's grandmother came to me in a dream and then I found out that she passed away maybe six to seven months after I tried to contact this person about a message that I got from their grandmother and then after that I had a dream like a while after that of the person they were dealing with being caught cheating. Um, I, I tried to basically speak on that for them because they were about to make a sad mistake. <clears throat> but um, with the two of swords, they couldn't see what I was talking about because they had invested in this person. But this person had invested in leaving them out in the cold. Okay. When I say leaving them out in the cold with the five of pentacles, I mean, they were never faithful to this person. And this person couldn't see that this female they were messing with was going to end up causing them a lot of strife uh, I just I don't take pleasure in knowing what I be finding out about things I mean I take pleasure in the person listening and avoiding the conflict but when they don't listen to me like that's what I'm getting here with this two of swords and the five of pentacles. They blocked me out and they left me out in the cold after I had been nothing but a good friend to them. Yep. So we have the ace of wands now. The ace of wands with the king of pentacles. I'm sorry, I got a text message. Cards my hair okay look let's just get down to it <laughs> now what's this ace of wands
Okay, so basically this Ace of Wands is a burden. They went and took a passionate new beginning with this person and it caused nothing but burdens because there were secrets. Now, me being a high priestess, I am allowed to see certain people's secrets, even if they're in the UK, even if they're in China. God will basically put me there. So let me describe it like this. What's this Ace of Pentacles? Okay, Ace of Pentacles and Strength. Okay. <laughs> I'm getting with this Ace of Pentacles and Strength that this person worked really hard for the achievements that they do have. But like I was explaining to you, it's kind of like, I wouldn't say a fly on a wall. I wouldn't say I would, I would be a fly on a wall per se because I'm actually in a person's body. I'm seeing from behind that person's eyes. So when I'm there, I'm kind of undetectable because I'm seeing through that person's eyes. But um, this person, he worked really hard for the pinnacle, this ace of pinnacles that he had, has. I don't really know what's going on with him currently. But um, They uh, tried really hard, is what I'm getting. This Gemini, he tried really hard to have this foundation. And he allowed her into his life, right? He actually got engaged to her. I don't know what's going on after that, but with the star he is a public figure he is a somewhat a celebrity the star and a nine of wands this is him having to heal after having to, to protect and defend his legacy that he already built so this person basically was lied to by a female. Now, I don't know all the specifics of the lies she told him to actually get him in her life, but I do know that she lied and said that she wasn't cheating on him, and she was. And then she popped up, no, let me, let me slow it down. And then God told me that one time when I was watching a live video this person is on YouTube I was watching a live video he was trying to get her to come with him because he was going to go work out and when I heard what she said saying her stomach hurts I was told by God she's pretty she's saying this because this is the pretense before telling him she's pregnant right so basically, she wasn't pregnant at the time, but she was making it seem like her stomach hurt because later she was gonna tell him she was pregnant. Now, this girl, let me ask God, was this girl already pregnant? Was she already pregnant? Oh wow, come on. Was she already pregnant? three of wands she was expecting she was already expecting and they were yeah because you see this the devil card speaks of temptation so she fed into her temptation with somebody else she was already pregnant okay 
Now, God, is that baby his baby or, let me ask, since she was already pregnant during that time, was it his baby? Was that his baby? Two of Pentacles. At that time, she didn't know whose baby it was because she had been messing with a King of Wands. sad because he's really a nice person and that's that's funny because <laughs> in the dream right okay so after i saw that video and god was like this is the pretense before her telling him that she's pregnant but with this two of pentacles she didn't know who the baby daddy was so she didn't want to say nothing yet so i believe that she convinced him somehow they ended up having sex unprotected, right? So that she can make it seem like that's his baby. Am I right, God? Am I right that after she knew she was pregnant, she had sex with him unprotected to claim him to be the father? Ten of Pentacles, yep. She did this for money. She did this for money because the person, and look, with the hangman, she was waiting to find out because she knew that he had already built an empire for himself and she wanted to be a part of it. But she allowed her whole nature to take over her instead of turning her life over with this good person that she was with. He's a good, faithful person. He's very understanding, very sweet person. And she misused his kindness and tried to pin a baby on him. Okay, so after that happened, um, I had a dream of him. She came over to his house. Mind you, I told you, it's like I'm in the person's body. So at this time, I had to bend behind his eyes because I saw it. I saw him picking up a coat off of his, cow, uh, off of his chair or something. Um, and it was like the coat was hanging over like a chair, like the arm of a chair. He picked it up. He was going to go hang it up, is what I'm hearing in his head. Let me hang this up. And he was like, in his mind, he was upset because he don't like things to be sloppy. I mentioned this in a previous video. He don't like things to be out of place, not sloppy. Like there's a place for everything. And that's how he lives his life. It's a time and place for everything. There's a place for everything. And when he was picking up the coat, he ended up I don't know what made him do it but he put his hand in the pocket and when he put his hand in the pocket he found a little piece of paper a little white piece of paper and it had like uh, it had like some kind of note on it that I'm being told she didn't know was in her coat pocket the person slipped it in her coat pocket for her to find later because they thought it was like cute like you know for her to find it later and it was like a little love note so when he saw that he went to her with the coat still in his hand and then the little note in his hand and he was like you know asking her so this is the type of woman you are and she was stuttering she then started to say you're a really nice person, like, you know, trying to, I don't know, trying to make him feel, like, appreciated in some kind of way. Yeah, that's what she was trying to do, mommy. Yeah, she was trying to make him feel appreciated in some kind of way. She told him he was a really nice person, and she didn't mean to hurt him, and... I basically 
woke up from the dream. Now, uh, my question is, is the person who wrote that note and left that note in her pocket the father of that child? He is, baby. Okay. Okay. Is he the father? Wow. Empress. Yo, he's the father of that child. Yes, mommy. He is the father of that child. So. Wow. So does. Does the Gemini know. Now that he is not the father. Yes. He knows now he's not the father. And he wants to, with this Knight of Cups and the Six of Wands. He wants to celebrate this, first of all. And uh, he wants to, what's this Knight of Cups? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. This Knight of Cups and the Four Swords is him contemplating on giving this. The Knight of Cups is not an apology. It's, it's an emotional. It's like um, basically he wants to say something that describes his feelings for me telling him. And with the four swords, he has been praying to God and he's been very thankful with the six of wands for being victorious over this situation. She did not get to trap him. Um, He is the King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. He is not a Taurus, but I don't know if he has Taurus in his chart. Page of Swords. He sees me as the Queen of Cups. The Page of Swords and the Queen of Cups. This is how he views me. And he wants to... Say thank you is what I'm hearing. I'm hearing he wants to say thank you. Okay. Well, you're welcome. No big deal. No problem. Oh, three of cups. Three of cups. He wants to celebrate this with me. Yeah. But he's all in his head about it. Okay. So he wants to celebrate with me. Two cards. Yeah, we got the chariot. Yeah, he wants us to meet up. So, he wants us to meet up to celebrate this. And this Three of Cups is basically like a celebration between friends. So, he wants to come. The Six of Swords from Karma Waters with the Chariot. The Chariot is success and achievement and moving forward with the Judgment at the bottom of the deck. Wow. And what else do I need to know about this guy? I mean, is it anything you want him to know? Oh, 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 see. We got the King of Pentacles, Queen of Swords, Queen of Pentacles. First thing I heard was me looking back at the information that I gave him. It is now being received. Yep. 
and is balancing things out. That's good. I don't want to say you, uh, because that's what I'm hearing. He's, he's, they, I didn't want to say it, but he's thinking that I'm going to say, I told you so. Like the way this Queen of Pentacles is looking back at this Queen of Swords, it's like, I've been told you so. Like, I told you like that. But I'm not that kind of person to say, I told you so. I mean, on my journey, I've already realized, first of all, I've never been the type of person to say, I told you so. But on my journey, I have realized that everybody is not going to be open to premonitions. They're not going to be always, you know, understanding of that. A lot of people run away from that because they be they start to think that you're crazy. But then when they see it, then they want to come and, you know, let you know that they are apologetic for how they treated you. We have the Two of Cups and the Seven of Swords. Yes. With this Queen of Swords, I'm not going to lie. I told him what was coming out of this relationship. I told him. I said, I'm not going to say exactly what I said, but this is what I said. Seven of Swords, Two of Cups. There is cheating and sneaking going on in this relationship. He is an emperor. He is a business owner. And he's a stand-up guy. So... He did not deserve that. And that is why, even though I kind of looked crazy telling him <laughs> when I told him, where I told him, because he's big on a time and place for everything, but I felt like there was no better time or place to let him know this. So I told him. And now he's seeing what I said was true. Am I right, God? Page of Wands. Good news. A message of good news. To protect himself. That's what I told him. I said, listen. She is only saying this. Shorty only saying she pregnant because she's trying to trap you. I told him that. I said, she's trying to trap you. We already know she's a cheater. We already know she cheated on you. Now, at the time, I didn't know if he knew it or not, but I knew from the dream of looking from behind his eyes. So that's why I said, we already know she cheated on you. So I don't know, you know. If he knew at the time or not. It, okay. Ace of Swords. Yep. It was true. It turned out to be true. And now he's been having sleepless nights. Up all night. Thinking, thinking, thinking. Can't believe he got himself caught up in this situation. You know. The high priestess. He's thinking about these secrets. And he's holding back. It's a Gemini with the lovers. He's holding back. What's this? Mm. With the Five of Cups. That is remorse and guilt and regrets. So he's feeling remorse and guilt for the way that he treated me when I told him that. But he's also feeling regret for not believing me and actually fucking with shorty like <sighs> and he's having sleepless nights about what I told him because it was the truth and he didn't see it with that two of swords that we had in the beginning let me find that two of swords that's what we started off with started off with the two of swords 
He did not see it. He did not know. God, is there anything else I need to mention in this reading for this Gemini? Is this something you want this Gemini to know, God? Nine of Pentacles. To be single. Get out of that connection. Look, with the four of wands. Celebrate being single. That's the message we're getting. He wants you to celebrate being single. Celebrate being happy. Yes. Yes. Oh, my God. Look at this. With the four of wands, the sun, and the seven of wands. This four of wands speaks of marriage, engagement, celebrating something like that, right? But God is advising him. Since this has all come to light, protect yourself from her and become single, separate from her. Because you have nine pentacles all by yourself. You actually have the ten of pentacles for real. All you need is your divine counterpart because you are an emperor. So you are a divine masculine. And all you need is your empress, your, your true empress. And... Wow, Nine of Cups, <laughs> Wish Fulfillment, and the Knight of Swords. Yeah, so he's going to come and say something about this being his Wish Fulfillment. With the Eight of Pentacles, he's going to say something on, look at King of Swords, Gemini. This Gemini is going to mention this at his workplace, um, which is on YouTube. He's going to be saying something about this. Okay. What's this Knight of Swords? What, what is he going to say? He's going to say. <laughs> wow, with the King of Cups. He's going to say he missed the opportunity. Now, you come on now. He missed the opportunity. He had to reject that situation. He definitely, definitely gonna mention that he had to let that situation go with the Three of Cups. But with the King of Cups and this, uh, this cup here given to him by the divine, he's gonna mention also having a missed opportunity with someone else because of that relationship that he uh jumped into am i am i getting that out right god and did i say everything correctly with this message let's see i hope i got everything out right i love to check myself honey I am not going to play. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We got the king of wands. That is uh, definitely correct. Oh, my goodness. With the knight of cups. That's an apology. I mean, I said knight. Page of cups. That's an apology. The fool taking a leap of faith. Oh, and a page of pentacles to start something else. And giving this other person justice. He's going to have justice. You will have justice. Okay? So don't you sweat it. Just be glad that you dodged that bullet, Mr. Mister. <laughs> and apology accepted. And, uh, ooh, high priestess. <laughs> high priestess and the hermit. Hmm. What's this hermit? Let me let me see. What's the hermit? What is the hermit got? What's this hermit energy? Oh, three of pentacles. Oh, he's leaving that situation. He's not 
collaborating. He's not working with her anymore. That's what he's going to announce on his social media. Whew. And he's regaining balance because he is all the way, all the way emotionally fucked up. You know, like when you think that you're you're expecting a baby, you're you're thinking that you're about to get married, you have been single for so long, all for it to be a setup from some female, it leaves you like this, like in regret and in grief. It's really sad. I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry that happened to you, but I'm glad that you were saved by the bell. <laughs> by the bell of God. Okay. Got anything else? Anything else you want me to know? Or anything you want me to let him know? If he does view this video? Is there anything else you want me to let him know? Obviously, he's going to view it if you're telling me to post this. You're telling me to do this video. So he's going to view this video. Now, this is a lot of cards, but God is telling you that he is going to give you this Ace of Cups. You're going to have new love. And that is your justice. So don't worry about it, okay? Don't worry about it. Believe. Believe in the unseen, because we here. <laughs> okay, let's get another oracle message to, to close out this uh, video for Mr. Mister. Let's see. What, what message do you want to close this video out with for Mr. Mister? And by the way, I have a tree in my house that I'm growing. I got two of them. But this this little flower here, she just budded today. Okay, so I'm happy. I put her in a, I put the tree in a big pot so it could grow in the house because I don't like bugs in my trees and my flowers. So I got it in the house. So, listen, I'm praying to God that it can grow in the house. I don't care if it grow to the ceiling. If it grow to the ceiling, by the time it grow to the ceiling, hopefully by then I'll have a house with some land that I could plant it on. Matter of fact, ain't no hopefully. That's what's going to happen. Boom. So, anyway, <laughs> uh, what message do you have for Mr. Mr. God? What do you want him to know? Closing out this message. Oh, commitment and confidence. Oh, have confidence in your next commitment because that commitment is going to be the Ace of Cups. It's going to be from God this time. Okay. And you will have a beautiful family. Family came out before. You're gonna have a beautiful merged family, okay? And look, we got grieving. You will heal from that, okay? Don't worry, God got your back. And even when you don't see, he gonna send somebody that's gonna be able to give you the heads up, okay? Until next time, see you later.